Hey everybody, obviously we are down here in lovely South Carolina. I'm at my storage, so I'm going to flip you guys around. We're going to give out a wholesale video today of the figures I just bought. Um, we did pretty well on the starting lineup wholesale deal about six months ago, so I bought another uh, action figure deal, so I'm gonna offer that out to you guys. So let's and I'll show you a little bit of what we have down here in South Carolina so far Okay, so here's our first unit Obviously Full of miscellaneous stuff. These are all vintage like single stitch t-shirts and concert t-shirts and some sneakers And there's you know Hot Wheels sets over there, and then this unit is mostly comic books so mostly vintage comics and there's some World War I posters and some other items in here. So we have that. Our second unit, is right next door, which is very convenient, is mostly sports cards, unopened sets, unopened boxes, uh, boxes of miscellaneous collections that I've bought over the last, gosh, over the last 10 or 15 years. This is all sports cards here in the front. Those round barrels are sports cards. There's more sports cards back there around the corner. That entire back over there is all pin back buttons. This area from about here back is all pin back buttons. Right there. Then here is you know, some Monopoly games and some stuff like that. So that's what we have in here. Oh, albums, record albums. There's actually some really good albums. And then, I also have another unit down there on the left somewhere. So we have four units here. Maybe I can take you down there and show that to you before we get into the meat and potatoes of this video. I think it's this one. Okay, so these are toys, uh, miscellaneous, so these are video games. Down in here, action figures, uh, there's CDs, VHS and sealed VHS, obviously Star Wars, more boxes of vintage action figures and long box CDs, which can be really, really good. More cassettes, you can see up in there, there's classic WWF, there's more figures throughout this unit, and then other collectibles, Advertising signs, there's a beer sign, uh, neon, and all kinds of stuff. This is for me to dig through at some point. Okay. Here's more WWF wrestlers, some like Hess trucks, and other toys. This one here says figures on it. So there's an old camera, there's some G.I. Joe. And more figures so this unit is full of treasures 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 and more treasures there's also a bunch of like really good sneakers in here and other stuff okay now let's show you guys what today's wholesale video will be for okay for those of you who watched the other week you know that I went to Pennsylvania I flew up there to buy a action figure deal I brought back a truckload. Here is a 15 foot deep by 12 foot wide unit stacked over six feet high with cases and cases and cases of action figures. All brand new on card. Um, mostly Kenner starting lineups and McFarlane sport picks and sport figures there are sets like these not too many of these little ones but stuff like that uh, let's see what we got up here so here's classic doubles a basketball one of, let's see who that is oh. As you can tell, they're in protectors. That's Dr. J. 
There are McFarlane, Vince Carter. There are Jordans, Kobe Bryant, Shaquille O'Neal, uh, LeBron James. We have bigger sets here with multiple figures inside. Some of the large figures. There is a huge stack in the back of like the three and four and five uh, piece sets. Let's see what I can pull down for you here. Just to give you an idea. Ugh, hard to do one handed. So, football. I can see Montana. I can see the Chase variant Montana. I can see both variations of Peyton, both variations of Lot. So that's just one case pulling off of the top here. Some really high-end variants mixed throughout this. These look like baseball. So you have Derek Lowe, Derek Jeter, must be the box of Derek's, Alfonso Soriano, uh, let's see who this is, Tori Hunter, so just tons of figures, Jason Giambi, and then you have vintage starting lineups here. Most of these have the, the sports cards with them that people are grading now. So these are all men on card figures throughout here. Um, I did open one box. There was actually like some Batman Beyond and uh, Batman figures. And then there was another box that was sealed original series like 92 um, Power Rangers. So those were really exciting. So who knows? I didn't go through every box yet. But what we're going to do is I'm going to offer out wholesale deals. Um, I think in the starting lineup video that I did, when I did wholesale starting lineups, they were strictly, you know, the Kenner starting lineups like this. Um, we did 10 for 100. This stuff we're going to do 9 for 100 because the McFarlands weigh a lot more. And they take a much bigger box. For me to to put three or four or five of these into a box and a lot of them have protective cases on them that the guy paid extra for so it's going to be nine figures for a hundred dollars shipped inside the united states you got a comment below comment down at the bottom um sold and then x and then how many deals you would like if you want three deals put sold X3 lots, and then email me at Mr. Buys a Lot. Up here, we're going to put the put our email, Mr. Buys a Lot 795 at gmail.com. And I have 6,000 figures, is how many I bought. You're going to get nine for $100 shipped, so you don't pay any extra shipping. Um, if you get a set like this, just as an example. So this has three figures in it. It counts as one figure. I'm not going to count that as three figures. So I'm just going to mix those in as we open up the cases. We're just going to start at the front, work our way towards the back. And as we open a case, we're going to put figures in. You will get a mix of Kenner and McFarlane. And if there's other stuff in the lots, then you'll probably get a mix of that too. Like once we find the Batman lot, that's going to go into packages. But like here... Here's a McFarlane double pack. Down there's another McFarlane double pack. These will only count as one figure. So when you get your nine pieces in your box, that may be one of them. You may get three McFarlanes and six starting lineups. Or you may get six McFarlanes and three starting lineups. Three Kenner starting lineups. Just will be based off of whatever's in the boxes that we're going through. I will try to give you guys a nice mix. Um, I'm not pulling anything out for myself, so we've been doing a, a couple in the auction just to go through them a little bit faster. But again, if you guys are interested in the sports figures, I'm going to say that they're mostly sports. You see those white boxes down there? Those are like mellow gift sets that like you had to belong to a club and had to send in so many of something to get. So those are pretty rare, actually. Uh, there are some figures that I saw that are two, three, four hundred dollar figures. 
they're still going to get mixed in the boxes. There are Jordans from, I think there's at least one case I saw of just Jordans from 90 and 91 uh, in there. Uh, I know I've saw LeBron. I know I've saw Kobe Bryant. I know I've saw Shaq. Um, all of your classic players, David Robinson, basketball, your baseball players that you would know, Conseco McGuire, all of those guys, Derek Jeter, uh, Chipper Jones, all of that stuff, NFL, you've got Brady, you've got Brett Favre, you've got um, Drew Brees, you know, you name it, it's in here for the most part. I don't know exactly which years. I would say the average is probably from 1990 to 2019, maybe. I can't remember how new I saw them uh, get up into. So you guys will know this stuff better than I do without me doing any research. It's easy for me just to flip the deal. If somebody wants to come down and buy all 6,000 figures at a wholesale price, email me. Um, I'll work with you. It'd probably be 30,000 would be my flip price. Um, and then you're paying, you know, five bucks a figure, which is a really good deal because there's some really great stuff in here. Um, but if somebody is buying them in individual lots, they will, you will get nine figures, nine carded figures, or nine figure sets for a hundred dollars shipped. So there will be some great deals. It will be a mix. You will not get to choose, hey, I just want McFarlane, or hey, I just want Kenner. It'll be a mix, whatever we come down and pull. You know, as we get orders, we'll come right here and pull them out and get them ready for you guys. So, hope you guys enjoy this video. We have a lot of stuff for sale. Most of the time it comes to our auctions on YouTube, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays from 1 until about 4.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I buy this amount of stuff weekly at, at some points. Uh, last, last week in Pennsylvania, I bought 60,000 items. So we are selling as much as we can, as fast as we can, and just trying to flip stuff and not store it. So make sure that you come to our auctions Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday from 1 until 4.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Watch the channel because we do do wholesale deals on a regular basis. And obviously if you know where some stuff's at that people want to sell, we're always available. So email MrBuysLot795 at gmail.com. Again, to purchase, comment sold, how many lots you would like. Email me at mrbizalot 795 at gmail.com. In that email will be your name, like your YouTube name, your real name, your mailing address, and your PayPal email address. We will invoice you for your lots. And once paid, they will go out generally within 48 hours. Okay, guys, hope you enjoy this video. There is some really awesome stuff in here. I'm kind of excited. It is perfect timing. Get this stuff before Christmas and before the buying rush with the price of everything going up through the roof. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Nine pieces for 100 bucks shipped. See you then.